Hey guys, Jignesh Jain here. Once again, I am back with another video for our Note 10 Plus. This time, it's also based on theming for Note 10 Plus. Currently, as you know, Substratum was not working for One UI 2.0 version. But now, they have recently added the support for One UI 2.0 version. And I'll show you which theme is currently working on our One UI 2.0 with Substratum and Synergy. So for this, you'll need in three applications. Let's get into it. First of all, you will need Synergy Substratum. So you'll need to install this Synergy One UI theme compiler. You will also need Substratum Lite theme engine and any of the theme which currently supports Android One UI 2.0. So I can say that partially Live Dark is sub currently supporting this theme live dark substratum theme this is currently supporting the one ui 2.0 version so you can easily use this uh, and you can see it's on sale i guess no the sale is completed i think so so as you know you can uh, download it from the play store app after paying if you want to and after everything is been in been installed just go to the synergy I am already on the Synergy theme, but I will be re-theming this. As you can see, I am using the blue shades right now. You can easily change it. Just go to the Synergy theme. And you will see the list which has been currently loading. So, first of all, I will delete all the imported overlays from here. So, it's gone. Now, what I will do is... As you can see, I have already disabled the Ace mode. Oh, sorry, enable the Ace mode, and if I want, I can disable. But I'll suggest that keep using this Ace mode. This is better. Then I'll what I'll do is add an overlays from Substratum Light. I'll use the Live Dark theme. I'll launch it and select the Samsung Pi. Yes, you should select Samsung Pi, not Oxygen OS 10 or Android 10. Just select Samsung Pi. Don't worry, it will work great for uh, or Android 2.0 version also. Make the changes you want. As currently you can see I am changing the colors. I will just select some different colors. So let us go with the gradient sunrise colors. And change the background color to light blue background. Light grey blue background. And you can change the other settings options if you want to. But I will just keep it as it is. And I will just install the selected theme. Once this is installed, it will automatically import the overlays and it will show up in the theme depths. It would take some time depending on the model you are using. So as you can see all the overlays are been shown here. Just select build. Please apply the default theme before continuing. As I am already using it, I will need to apply the default theme from here. So guys, after you have enabled and installed the default theme, just click on the build button. It will start building the theme. As you can see, it will ask you to install Synergy as theme. Just install it. Just install it correctly. No need to worry. So as you can see, the theme has been installed. What we need to do is one apply Synergy as theme from Theme Galaxy. Then apply the high contrast theme from Synergy S itself and then reboot the device. So let us go there. As you can see this theme has been prepared. Make sure you just click on try it out and not anything else. So just click. So this is how it would look. This is how it will look after applying the theme. And it will just say that uh, next step is to apply the hex plus theme. But before moving that just check the details here. Just check that whatever you wanted has been themed. As you can see everything is themed for me. I will just go and go to the next step. I will select this high contrast theme from here. This. This would show you, show you the synergy icon itself. 
so that's it guys just click on apply and reboot your device after reboot the device would be themed so i hope this help you guys if you have any question you can just ask in the video below and uh, for the application you can download it from play store so bye guys take care